Hello, my name is Monica and I'm in Zimbabwe. I'm from Zimbabwe. This is my first um, recording for my journey in cutting and polishing in Zimbabwe. So I've just ordered my machine from China. I ordered a saw and a faceting machine. So I'm going to be showing you my journey as I learn to cut and polish and my journey as I get my licenses, my journey as I do the training. I'm going to be trained by a, an, an old cutter who's been doing it for years here in Zimbabwe. Um, so he said, you'll teach me. And I've also been watching like loads of YouTube videos to try and get, you know, a feel for it and to try and understand. I, I understand part of it, but I guess now that I have the machine, um, it'll kind of make more sense to me. But um, I'm excited to embark on this journey. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm also going to be applying for all the licenses that I'll need to get set up um, to actually start doing my own faceting and polishing. And I will show you every step of the way as, I, um, as I'm on my journey. And I am going to also show you when I'm being trained by Nguenya, um, the cutter, um, and we'll see i hope i i hope i understand it you know like i don't look too dumb when he's teaching me because yeah <laughs> it's, it's gonna be interesting you know it's gonna be very interesting so um it took a month for my machine to arrive and it was hectic um at the airport um, we had a dispute about how much duty i should be pre paying for this machine see in zim the thing is it's not very common to have faceting machines or to have people who actually do it. it it's like a really very very few people and i had to prove that no it's actually not expensive i had all my documents i showed them and then after weeks my machine was finally delivered um to my house and i'm happy it's, it's really great so it's still in the box um so this is this is it it's the, the, this is the saw and then this is the faceting machine um still all in the box so i'll show you when i open it and i need to set up a studio so my space is well it's it's like um it's an office that we have but it's got a lot of junk in it so i need to to clear out all this junk like see there's like stuff in here there's even a bed in one corner there's my my baby's pram um and then we have you know golf clubs over there we have a desk um my machine is and then i want to set up in the corner so i need to create an actual proper studio so that um you know i can work in a, in, a, in a good vibe in a good environment and so that i can even have clients coming in and feeling that oh yeah this looks very professional I've, she looks like she can cut my stone you know so it's gonna be great so okay so the next part part two i'll be opening up my machines for now Thank you for watching.